there is a folder on the table. Let's see what other twisted jag off this one's gonna outline for us. <sighs> on Wednesday, 10th, February 1954, hypnotic experimentation and research was continued in Building 13 of the Mount Massive Preserve in Colorado using the following subjects. Material abridged. Post-hypnotic of the night before, pointed finger, you will sleep, was enacted. Mrs. Jackson and Pierce immediately progressed to a deep hypnotic state with no further suggestion. Ms. Pierce was then instructed, having previously expressed a fear of firearms in any fashion, that she would use every method at her disposal to awaken Miss Jackson, now in a deep hypnotic sleep, and that failing this, she would pick up a nearby pistol and fire it at Miss Jackson. She was instructed that her rage would be so great that she would not hesitate to kill Jackson for having failed to awaken. Miss Pierce carried out these suggestions to the letter, including firing the unloaded pneumatic pistol gun at Jackson and then proceeding to fall into a deep sleep. After proper suggestions were made, both were awakened and experienced complete amnesia for the entire sequence. Miss Pierce was again handed the gun, which she refused in an awakened state to pick up or accept from the operator. She expressed absolute denial that the foregoing sequence was distressing. So they're getting all Manchurian candidate with these guys, and they're turning them into assassins. More like Russian sleep uh, experiments. Do you remember that? Have you ever seen that creepy pasta? Yeah. This is basically Russian sleep experiments, the game. Jesus, there was a whole hallway there, and you, and you wouldn't have known if there was someone crouching over there without that thing on. Yep. Do you want me to go get you another beer, or...? Yes. Do you want this Budweiser right here? And I'll go get me some more? Ah, uh, sure. Because you're probably going to need it. Okay. There you go. Who's there? Careful, he will kill you. There's a guy in the room. He's so loud. Okay. Now what the fuck do I do? Okay. guy has been collecting heads. It's not a good guy. I missed a quiet room full of TV. I missed the room. find some more. Gas generator. Take a look around the room, see if there's any place to hide in here. Okay, lockers, cool. Gas generator. Now hide, immediately. No! Oh. Something we shake in the room. 
thought I heard somebody lurking around out there. Oh, there was a there was a guy. Shit. <gasps> He's got a bat. He's got a board with nails in it. That'll kill okay. you. Some reading material will help me relax. <laughs> uh, a crowd of broken men watching a dead channel. They looked like patients. They survived whatever happened here, but nobody's home. Big fucking guy. <laughs> this big fucker is staring at me. Found a patient file for a Chris Walker XMP. Several tours in Afghanistan. A lot of the blood in this place is on his hands, but not all of it. I'm going to call him the big pig. Accurate. Because he calls you Little Piggy. Uh, can we avoid pet names for the psychotics, please? Don't worry. You've only met one character in this cast. There's plenty of them. There's something going over there. Oh, it's a battery. Grab some. He won't just wander in here, but he will wander into every room that you activate the generator in, so... Careful. You can zoom in and out with the camera to try to get see further down a hallway to try to figure out where he's at. If he spots you, run. Just run down a hallway and see if you can find a room with some place to hide. So fucking loud. That's He's not helping. <laughs> Shit. Back up, back up, back up. Shit, run. Ah! Run, 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 run. back to his normal patrolling area. There he said are... he wouldn't be in the rooms! No, no, he'll be out. That, that, that part out there, that was out in the hallway. He walked out of the door I was trying to get into. That, that's another, that's part of the hallway. It's part of his patrol route. Uh... You need to get past him. There are plenty of places out. No, no, that's the way back upstairs. You can't go that way. Well, I can, but it's useless. Yeah. So you need to wait till he patrols further into the room and sneak behind him. Or just try to run past him and find a place to hide, uh, because there's plenty of places to hide past him in that hallway, too. I often find myself just going for it in this game. Like, when my fear starts to take root and I start to get paralyzed, I just run and hope that the adrenaline kicks in and I find a place to hide. That on there. Maybe that's the other room I need to get into. Uh, that's one of them, yeah. Oh, god damn it. I didn't think you were in here. There he 
is. Okay, wait till he moves back into the back of the room and then try to sneak past him. He shouldn't patrol out here. Okay, there he goes. Bleeding batteries here. You got it. Yolo, it. Run past him. Yolo. Go. Did he just sh you? I drink when I cry, and I cry because I drink. Is he out of the room yet? Yeah. Alright, there were some batteries on the thing next to you. Grab him. And then peek out the door, and when he's gone, start exploring. We got two more switches to hit, Bob. We can't bitch out now. The game's only just started. See, especially when you're in the dark. Later on, there's a part where you have to hide from Chris, and he's literally on the other side of a door from you. Ah, jeez, dude. So many dudes all sprung up predator style. Why would you, why do you keep putting the thing away while you're... See if there's light? Oh. That's the other side of that thing. The part, the part where you heard him growling at you the first time? I think one of the switches is down here. Yeah. Okay, so this must be the hard one then. Yes, this is the, this is the one you're supposed to do last. You actually did one of the easier, or you actually uh, skipped one of the easier ones. That other door yeah. that he spooked me on. Okay, so on and hide because it's gonna make noise. Didn't seem to do anything. Yeah, it didn't make a lot of noise. Oh, maybe you have to, damn it, maybe you have to come back here later. Mm. Actually, no, it's on now, so you shouldn't have to worry about it. Yeah, so just getting here is hard. Yeah, because you have to go past it. A lot of players get get scared off because, uh... Well, that's because it's fucking into... It is terrifying. <gasps> backwards, backwards. Why would he come in here anyway? Because he couldn't find you. If he opens the lock, you just have to run. Oh, he opened one of the other ones. 